Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and a new video on Survival Challenge Multiplayer with Dagoin. Uh, so it's another new day today and uh, the crops are all growing well but unfortunately nothing's ready to harvest today at the moment. So um, we're going to have to do some more trees. Um, we need the money. <laughs> so uh, we're going to have to make some money somehow and trees is the obvious way of doing it at the moment. That's a crop, Dagoin, don't drive in that. Yep. <laughs> What's he doing? Yeah, anyway, yeah, so um, we're going to go and cut these trees in the middle of this field. It needs drilling, but we don't want to be drilling that until we've cut some of these trees. So yeah, we'll, we'll cut a few of these trees down and sell them. And then we'll have some more money available. We've only got the one trailer at the moment, but that, that should be fine. The other trailer's uh, still set up for grain. But I think we'll just, we'll just both of us label one, one trailer for a start. Anyway, I'll guess when we're doing these, this logging on a time lapse because it's a bit boring to keep watching this.
right, so we've uh, got a few logs loaded there. We've already taken one load and we've got 10,000 for that, and then that's a massive load there. So hopefully we'll get, I don't know, what would it be, 12, maybe 12,000 at least for that. He's a bit too heavy for the tractor though, that's the downside. <laughs> He's going to have fun with that. That is going to be a lot of weight on that trailer. We do really need a bigger trailer for these logs. We need a proper logging trailer, but again, they're, they're quite expensive, so yeah. <laughs> In the future, I'm sure we will get one. Uh, I think what I can do now, now I've cleared a bit more space in this field, is I'll cultivate this area where we've just cleared. Obviously the stumps need to go as well, but so we can easily see the stumps. Let's uh, go around with the cultivator. And uh, so we, this will improve or increase the amount of area we can uh, plant when we do plant it. It should be quite soon. Yeah, the downside is, of course, the stumps get in the way of the cultivator. It's not ideal, but yeah, it'll, it'll be alright. Once I've done this, I will. Um, oh no, he's got stuck, has he? <laughs> oh dear. Right. Go and help Dago in then. Let's go and see what he's doing. There he is on the hill. Let's push the front of the track too. Really. <laughs> this is certainly not ideal. Mess. The sooner we can get some bigger tractors, the better. Yeah, I was, I was thinking this is going to be a good load because it, there's obviously a lot of logs on there, but obviously, yeah, with the weight of these tractors, it's too much weight on the trailer. <laughs> you know, I think the back of the tractors is now off the ground as well. It won't be helping as well that the logs are a bit too long. But I'm just uh, hoping you'll get to the sawmill, okay? <laughs> it's going to flip it. Oh no. Well, we've got it back on, the, on its wheels again. Dagger in saw on his side. Let's flip him back over as well. There we go. <laughs> This is certainly not the best way of getting the logs to the sawmill, but it's very entertaining, of course. I want to try and push him all the way, but the problem is, as soon as he gets any speed up, he just loses control of it. Because there's just no, there's no control in the tractor, because of the weight. It's going to flip me over as well. I wish it wasn't so fast to get to the sawmill, well, you've got to go uphill as well. This is supposed to be the easy part going down the hill. Going up again will be even harder. Shall I try? I'll see if I try. I was going to try. This is when being able to talk to each other properly would be a lot easier. But as I've said before, Dagoin doesn't want to do that because he records with his sound off. And he says he won't be able to hear me if I talk to him. But it would, I agree, it would be a lot easier. I'd like to do it, but you have to convince Dagoin. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, it's, this is really hard. And it's going dark, which isn't healthy either. No idea if I'm going to get up this hill. It'd be nice if we could go in a straight line. It's going to really struggle on this steep part. I'm getting a push. <laughs> but as soon as you get any speed up, the other tractor just lose control again. 
like that. Oh, I'm looking forward to getting some bigger tractors. This is where we're in danger of turning the trailer over again because we're going, yeah, it's, this is really steep just here. I do not want to be turning on that. I'm going to try and stay on the track. I don't, I don't want to be pushed over. <laughs> I think just going really slow is the best way of doing it. We will get there, I'm sure, eventually. It's just very slow. Put some lights on. It's not far to go now, we've just got to go around the building and on the other side. We're very close. This is certainly our biggest ever load. So I don't know what we're going to get for this. It'd be nice to think we can get 15,000 for it, but I'm not sure whether we'll get that much. My thinking is somewhere between 12 and 15,000. Right, last second. I don't know if I'm in the trigger, I've got the trigger turned off. Oh no, if I'm in the trigger. I'm not quite in the trigger. Yeah, so right, now we're going to push the trailer into the trigger. It's almost there. Whether that's close enough. One more step. Okay. <laughs> Done it. Finally. I didn't look how much that was. I think it was around thirteen to fourteen thousand in total. I was focusing on trying to get all the logs in the trigger. I don't know why it does that as well, it's another multiplayer thing. <laughs> Dagoin's not standing there. He's over here, but yeah, that's weird. Anyway, yes, back to the field again. It's daytime again now, that's good. You can actually see what we're doing. And uh, now we've got some crops ready to harvest, which is good. I'll do this one, I think, first. Was this a crop hole? I think it was wheat, was it? Yes, it's wheat. And this has got straw as well, so we can bale this, put it on straw. So we can get an extra bonus money for the straw. Dagwin probably might start bailing that. Oh, he's bringing the trailer for a start. I'm sure he'll start bailing that. It is going to fill up quite quickly though, because it's, uh, wheat's the highest yielding crop, and we've only got a small tank on this combine. So uh, it won't take long, I don't even know if we'll get all the way around. We'll find out. Unlikely, I'd say. This is one of our bigger fields of the three we have. <laughs> Not that we've got much at the moment, but yeah, this is this is our second biggest field now, if we're including the one we haven't fully finished yet, the new one. This is good anyway, it's finally getting some more money to come in from another source other than just trees. Some crops, and not only that, but we're getting towards December, which is the best selling or best uh, price month for, for wheat, I think. Which is good. Which we'll get almost the maximum, or probably even the maximum amount we can get for the wheat, depending on whether we sell it now or wait another month. Probably we'll have to sell it now, but I think it will be okay. Still be a good price in November. We're 50% full now. We might get round. We're around about halfway. Actually, I think Dagoin on the mini map is following me around with the trailer anyway, so it's not an issue. 
I did get a full, I can always unload on the, or pull in somewhere and it's in the, unload me. Oh no, he's bailing. Oh, it's over there, yeah, that's right, so, yeah. I should get to the trailer. Got to go now, I'm on 70% almost. Yeah, here we are, we've just got around 94%, we're on 95%, we're good at it, so that's fine. Just the perfect distance, really. So now I'll unload this and get on with the harvest. Mine got full while Darwin was unloading the trailer. He's just sold that load and uh, we're going to swap over now. So he's going to take over on the combine and I will, uh, I'll do the bailing. That could stay there for now. So the, uh, the baler's over here. The other job I was thinking might need to be done is uh, the pallets at the greenhouse probably need to be moved out of the way because uh, they haven't been done for a while. I haven't, I haven't done them anyway. So um, that probably needs doing, but that can be done once this is done. Do the bailing for a start. So yeah, I'll, uh, I'll get on with the bailing while Dagawin continues the harvest. I've probably done about half the field, I think. The, the bigger half, and then Dagawin can do the other bit. And I'll get on with this.
that's the bailing done and the harvest done as well. Dagwin just finished the harvest and he's gone to sell the last load of wheat. Um, oh, there's a bit here I'll just get. There were a few missed bits I noticed, I tried to get them, but there's the odd bit here and there. There we go. That'll do. So this can go back to the yard now. And uh, yeah, as I mentioned, the, uh, there's probably a few pallets to move out of the way at the greenhouses. Just selling the wheat now that money's going up. And what we'll get for that load, I think it was, what was it, that 12,000 I think, for the last one. Oh, not quite. I don't know if that was a full load. About, um, what's that, 8,600? roughly, but not too bad that, because that's not the whole field, that's only one load. Um, right, pallet forks. I'll drop these off here. That's the pallet forks picked up, so I'll uh, go over to the greenhouses now and see how many pallets we've got. I think they'll be pretty full. Yeah, it looks like we've got almost, is it both lines full? Almost anyway, so I'll, I'll give them a push along. I'll push them, I'll go reverse back in and push them this way so that they're easier to get out again. Rather than pushing them further back. Don't want to be doing that. Yeah, there is room for more luckily, but I'll, I will move them now so that we know we've got space for more. We'll be selling these very soon actually. We'll be selling them in either December or January. I forget which is the best month, it's one of those two. But if they're pushed out of the way, there'll be room for more to spawn. Yeah, and I'll, uh, I'll push the same with the other side. There might be some more water as well, I'll do that as well while I'm here. Should make quite a bit of money from these. So we're going to sell them when the price is at the best. Oh, looks like there's some more left in the combine. Just sold another load of wheat. A small amount of wheat, very small amount of wheat. Yeah, he's finished now. So uh, I'll just push them to there. And then I'll just fill the bows out of water and top the greenhouses up. Don't want to drive on the crop. It's not been left in the best place. Not sure if I'm going to get that. This area does need some more work. So it's not the not the best layout here having a crop like that. Okay, I've uh, filled the bowser up and I'll go and see how much these greenhouses need. They might need more than one load. Because they haven't been done for a while or one probably one load each I should think. See if it takes all this. It's going to, isn't it? Yep. So we're going to, I'll get one more load for that other greenhouse. So they're both being topped up the same. I've been filling up from just here. It works okay here. It's not too steep because this rock helps. It's like a platform for reversing here. Allows you to fill up without it being too steep. Just missed it a bit. I'll, I'll straighten up and go back next to it. It's a bit too tall there. Go a bit more this way. Should work now. There we go. Well, 
once I've done this that'll be it for today so another pretty productive episode we've cut quite a few trees down so eventually yeah the plan is we're going to clear that island of trees in the middle of that field so we've got one very big field with no obstructions that way the help will be able to work better on that field when we when we get if we need a help to, to do some jobs that's the plan for that field and then um, you know harvested the wheat field and then uh, I've just sorted out the greenhouses so yeah it's not going too bad today apart from the, uh, the fun we had with the overloaded trailer which was uh, <laughs> a bit too much but we do need to get a bigger trailer we're getting to the stage now we've got a bit more money in the bank so maybe that's something we can think about getting um, we also want a sprayer ideally to do the weeds because our weed is far too small I'll leave this bows this way around this time so it doesn't have to go in the crop to get it out again anyway yep yeah, there we go so uh, hope you've enjoyed today's video and I'll see you again in the next one very soon <laughs>